In this video, I'm going to show you how to save a single toolpath to send to your CNC machine. If I click on the plus sign next to toolpaths in the project tree, it opens up all of the toolpaths that I've created. And here you can see I've created a profile toolpath. If I select toolpaths, it opens up all of the toolpath options on the bottom right of the screen for me. If I click here to save the toolpaths, you can see that I have the Save Toolpaths dialog box pop up. So here you can see all of the toolpaths to save. I only have the one which is the profile on the right hand side here. And I'm going to save that to send to my machine. It asks me where I wish to save this. If I click on the arrow here, it would normally give me a drop down of my favorite locations or my recently used locations. What I'm going to do is to give this a file name and I'm just going to call this single toolpath. And I'm going to browse. Now I'm going to do this in a G-code folder that I've created on my desktop and click open. Now you can see that it's changed the location to save this. The machine file format is the post processor that is used to configure the data from ArtCam into G-code or machine code for your specific machine. So here you can see all of the post processors that are available to ArtCam. Now there are well over 200 posts available within here so you should find your machine. There's also a generic G-code post processor here so that's the one that I'm going to use and I'm just going to click save. Now if I open up my folder you can see here that I have my single toolpath and if I double click on that you can see all of the G code and then this file is ready to be sent to my machine for cutting. 